So guys, since I have the oven on, I'm cooking um, the Pudu chicken that we got. I'm going to make a quiche. So I have one um, pie crust. So I'm going to let that just soften a little bit while I am chopping the vegetables. I have some uh, feta looking really nice. Um, small onion, some garlic, scallions that need to go, two tomatoes. Um, and I have another two tomatoes over here. I, I think I'm only going to need two. I have some spinach out of the freezer that I have that big bag of tray of eggs. And remember the pepper I got last week for free at Little with the five dollar, uh, the ten dollar coupon I had to use up. Anyway, so I'm going to be making a quiche for our breakfast in the morning. And did you know that you can freeze quiche and it, you can either um, do it in a whole pan and uh, freeze the whole thing, or you can do individual slices. I do individual slices, so stay back for a minute and I'll show you what I finished. So I have the vegetables cut up, tomato, onions, scallions, peppers, cheese is ready, I have the garlic crushed, I have eight eggs in the back, the spinach is out slightly tall, you can see the icicles on it, it's perfectly fine, don't worry, and the crust is softened. I'm going to be adding black pepper and Himalayan salt. So you just have to pop the ingredients in, whisk your eggs with a little bit of milk i add the salt and pepper to the eggs and whisk nicely put the ingredients into um, your tray on top of your um, pastry and pour the eggs on top and pop into your oven for 25 minutes at 375. so i just added some corn frozen corn to the top of it because um, it was looking a little red <laughs> from all the tomatoes and peppers just add the cheese and next it will be the eggs so you can use up all the little bits of ingredients that you have this is what it looks like just before it goes into the oven so there you have it the quiche is out of the oven it looks delicious um, really fresh smells beautiful and there's eight servings in this dish and there was eight eggs used and leftover vegetables out of the fridge so use what you have batch cook and meal prep and save yourself um, as much dollars as you possibly can live on the daily living rate and reduce your cost of living it is crucial to becoming debt free but uh, don't sacrifice quality over quantity make sure that you're feeding your family fresh ingredients healthy ingredients um, at a lower cost follow me for more inspiration have a great night everybody bye bye